What's good with the gang? What's good with the squad? What's good with the nation, yo? And we back at you on Scoop Squad TV, man. And we about to do a reaction, man. Pretty much an opinion, not even a reaction, just an opinion on how y'all feel about rapper Pop Smoke getting arrested for transporting this Rolls Royce, man. You know what I'm saying? This stolen Rolls Royce. How do y'all feel? What's y'all opinion on it, man? A lot of people got details. A lot of people don't. You know what I'm saying? It just it just came out of nowhere. Just a couple of days ago, everybody was posting him about him talking shit to Casanova, or you know what I'm saying, beefing with Casanova, or him with the Bugatti in the video. You know what I'm saying? New music dropping. You know what I'm saying? He was up. He was coming up. So I mean, like, what's the point now? Uh, they want to catch this man in their stolen Roy's Royce, but he been in brand new motherfucking whips. Y'all been seeing this nigga buy $100,000 chains, all types of shit. So what's the opinion of y'all feeling about this stolen Rolls Royce, man? Let's tap in, see what other couple of people got to talk about. Give me your opinion, man. Let's get it. This video is sponsored by American Rebel Apparel. <laughs> Exactly. That mean that man seemed way too relaxed and way too on the camera to be in a Rolls Royce. You know what I'm saying? A stolen Rolls Royce. He can't be that motherfucking cool. He can't be that motherfucking copacetic and that up, just calm and laid back. Nigga, if you in a stolen Rolls Royce, nigga, ain't you ain't on no cameras. You ain't about to let nobody know shit. Pure real Jack boy shit. You know what I'm saying? See, and man, I've been hearing about this dude Pop Smoke for a minute. Really, I'm the type of person when I start hearing about a new artist, I kind of check their interviews to see if they aura or what they talking about matches with, you know, like their body language and stuff. After hearing a few songs, and he do have a different type of style coming about in New York, but he was recently arrested for transporting a stolen Rolls Royce. Now, rapper Papa Smoke, who features on Travis Scott's new album Jack Boy, is taking the title too far according to sources. Now, the federal agents who busted him for allegedly transporting a stolen Rolls Royce, according to court documents, Pop Smoke was arrested Friday morning in New York on a federal charge of interstate transport of a stolen vehicle. Damn, then they're trying to say he taking this Jack Boy shit too serious. Like, you know what I'm saying? Now that I'm getting down to the bottom of it, if this man really did just steal a Rolls Royce and like for the Jack Boy shit, it's all promotion. He planned this shit like, all right, I'm about to make sure motherfuckers tap in with me, with what the fuck I got going on, even if I got to go to jail behind this shit or, you know what I'm saying, do some type of stunt to get to where I need to get. You see what the fuck's of, uh, whatever old boy was doing that was on the billboard by his motherfucking billboards that he was on top of that motherfucker dancing on that motherfucker. Like, everybody was doing everything to get that shit known and get that music popping, to get that shit to the charts. You see what Justin Bieber did. You see what Selena Gomez is doing, you know what I'm saying? And they already mainstream pop artists that had already made millions and, you know what I'm saying, made an impact, but they still need that number one. So everybody on the internet is doing whatever they got to do to get them eyes on them clout, you know what I'm saying? That's all it's about, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to this music and thriving in this shit and being major and being mainstream number one it's all about the, the clout man i don't care what nobody say then then that's when then that's when the money flowing motherfuckers think oh you can't get the money without the clout real shit that's what they be thinking on everything but free your boy pop smoke i'm pretty sure he out by now if he's not you know what i'm saying it's a whole lot of shit that's gonna go rival down through this whole week or past couple of days. He gonna have something to say. Somebody gonna say something about this shit. It ain't over with yet, man. Real shit. Specifically a 2019 Rolls Royce Wraith from Cali. Now the law enforcement sources tell us Pop Smoke met a Rolls Royce owner in November 
at a LA recording studio and they enter into a verbal agreement for Pop Smoke to use the car in the upcoming music video. In exchange, he would give the owner VIP treatment at a future show. Now, the sources say that the car owner told Pop Smoke to return the car the next day. And when that didn't happen, the owner tracked the car to Arizona using his GPS and then reported it stolen. Oh, and damn. So we're told that the owner noticed that the road. So you mean to tell me that motherfucking picture on Instagram he took, is that the same motherfucker he got the car from? See, that's what I'm saying. Now it's just feel now, now I'm saying like you don't know who the you can't trust nobody, man. If you can't buy that shit straight out, man. Or you if motherfuckers knew what they had going on, there's contracts and lit litigation going on behind that shit, so Royce popped up in Pop Smoke's social media post with the location tagged in New York. Now that particular post they say has been deleted. And other sources say Pop Smoke was busted at JFK Airport after returning from a Paris Fashion Week. And he'll be arraigned Friday afternoon in Brooklyn. Now this is crazy. I don't know if it was a misunderstanding in the verbal agreement, if this is something that he purposely did or not until further information come out. I would just hate, you know, these new dudes, these younger guys, these men that's coming out of the game, coming straight up out the streets. Yeah, the group or the they name is the Jack Boys, and they carry these images. I hope this is not something that he did. There's no way right. that you just going to steal someone's Rolls Royce and flaunt it around and put it on social media. Exactly. It's something behind that shit. Somebody just said something to where he, they where he must have felt like, all right, I'm renting this shit, or I'm leasing this shit, or I'm, or I'm owning this shit, or I'm just borrowing it. So I can, you know what I'm saying? Or that nigga Pop Smoke just was like, you know what? This is a good opportunity for me to go harder. Just do some do some crazy ass shit. You know what I'm saying? To get to get this notoriety, get this clout. You know what I'm saying? This is another way. Another all eyes on, on him moment. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Pop Smoke, man, because he do got some dope ass music, though. You know what I'm saying? His own drill style, in my opinion, how his voice is and shit. That's what it does a lot of part of his music. But, man. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta just stay away from the fuckery, man. Stay away from the fuckery. I think it's not gonna come back to you. Hopefully, it was just a misunderstanding. Exactly. The time and dates, who knows? Because it would be the dumbest thing possible for you to make it about the block, make it about your situation, regardless if you was getting money in the streets or not, to make it to this level to be able to get legal money and go around to Paris and see the rest of the world for a mistake like this to knock you off your square early in the game. Right. So some lower level thinking motherfuckers, they may be like, oh, okay, yeah, that's that's what's up, is keeping up with this image. But in the business mind, a grown man mind, once you get the opportunity to make it, you got to stay focused, keep your head low and handle your business, man, because you're going to have a lot of people who already got a lot of people depending on... Big facts, man. Shout out to Doc Hicks Television. Make sure y'all go chat in, subscribe to his channel, man, because this is what I'm, I'm reacting to his video and giving my opinion on this video. You know what I'm saying? So much love and appreciation to Doc Hicks Television, man. Doc Hicks Television. Go tap in, man. For you, but most importantly, you got to be dependent on you to change your life and circumstances. So hopefully, you can create some generational wealth to change your lifestyles and kids' lifestyles and, and other people around you. But if further information come out, I'll holler at you boys. Make sure you leave a comment, hit like, and share this video. Peace. American Rebel Apparel, man. Make sure y'all go tap in with that as well, man. Official online clothing store, man. American Rebel Apparel, man. But without further ado, man, I want to give my opinion. You know what I'm saying? And I want y'all to give y'all opinions in the comment below, man. Tell me how y'all feel about this Pop Smoke situation, about the stolen Rolls Royce and him leaving. You know what I'm saying? Going to back to New York with the car and he was supposed to be in Cali, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit crazy. They talking about the car's worth 375000 You know what I'm saying? They found that motherfucker parked outside the home of Pop Smoke's mother in the Brooklyn area. That's crazy. The officials said who... The officials who spoke on the condition of the anonymity to discuss and continue investigation. The license plate has been charged and the windows has been tinted. Oh, it's been changed. So they changed, so he changed the license plates and then tinted the windows. Yeah, he was low in that motherfucker. <laughs> Shout out to the gang, man. Shout out to the squad, man. Get y'all opinion, man. I just feel like it was a misunderstanding. I feel like it's just 
like I said, a whole bunch of smoke and mirrors, guys. We never know. We never fucking know. It could just be a whole bunch of sponsor and promotion going on. That's what a lot of this shit be about, man. But I'm just giving my opinion, man, on both sides of it. It could be that, or if it is, it's somebody had like a fucked up misunderstanding about this Rolls Royce, you know what I'm saying? Because ain't nobody just going to take nobody's shit on GP and then let them, you know what I'm saying? It might have been a rental and he ain't bring that shit back. It might have been a rental and he thought he must had it for more than one day, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, man. Shout out to the gang. Like I said, go tap in. Doc Hicks Television, man. Go like, share, subscribe, man. Shout out to you, my brother. Much love. Thank <laughs> you.